in this video i will show you how to grow coriander or cilantro as it is known as without much effort set and forget method this is a cracky method in which i'll be using natural sunlight and thus no artificial lights water pumps or regular watering is required this is gardening for busy people like myself so the things that you'll need are of course some coriander seeds only a few of them i also have this used empty yogurt bucket five kilogram which comes with the yogurt uh, that i buy from local indian shop i also have this net pot that i bought for two dollars which happens to be a perfect fit for this uh, bucket you will also need some suitable hydroponic solution i have this one which is known as hydroponic bloom hydro bloom sorry uh, you'll also need a measuring cup to make the solution according to whatever the instructions are and as you can see i have already made my solution in six liters of water another thing you'll need is coconut coir which can also be bought either online or from any local store and i'll fill this net pot with coconut coir so this is the coconut coir that i'm using it is just ground coconut husk which does not have any nutrients within it but it happens to be one of the best media to grow coriander and fenugreek it is uh, quite deep uh, and i'll fill it with coconut coir here i am again uh, inside my house with net cup filled with coconut coir i will fill half of this bucket with hydroponic solution and i will simply put this net cup on top of the bucket the next thing i'll sprinkle coriander seeds on top of the coir mix them well spread them evenly and cover them with a bit more coir do not use any other coir other than coconut uh, because they are usually made from uh, barks which tend to absorb nutrients especially deprive plants of nitrogen which is essential for plant growth next i will simply spray some water to make the seeds to make sure that the seeds are wet to start germination process and after that i'll take this bucket outside and keep it in a place where there is some sun but not too much sun coriander is a winter crop it cannot be grown in hot season unless you can find a cool spot and all this you have to do you may have to add uh, some more nutrient solution after a month or so if the pot is drying up never fill the bucket too much at, uh, as it will drown the roots also make sure that the coir is not too dry and once you have used the method a couple of times you'll have a very good idea of what to do and what not to do so these are plants after 10 or 12 days or so and you can see that they are healthy seedlings at the moment i have not given them any more water nor sprayed anything i had to add some hydroponic solution because it was not too much uh, this is another view uh, a bit close up and i'm quite happy with the growth this is another view just to show you where these uh, plants are sitting outside my house uh, not too much sunny not uh, so shady so average uh, amount of sun this is homegrown fresh coriander after five weeks or so and i already have used a few leaves from this area as you can see 
Um, and to tell you the truth, I was overseas for three weeks during this period. If the plants had grown in soil, they would have died as there was no one to water them. Uh, reasonably healthy roots. If I'm happy to wait another month or so, plants will grow even taller and will have many more leaves. I hope uh, this is of some help and I hope you enjoyed the video. Please press like button and subscribe. If you learned something, thank you for watching.